What's up, everybody? This is Sticks. No, no, no. Don't track there. <laughs> What's up, everybody? This is Sticks. And um, I just wanted to talk to y'all a little bit. So, last night, excuse me. Last night, I did a how to seduce your crush. But also, I did a Uno. And it was like Sticks with friends. And, um... I want you to be open to this new content. This new content is going to teach you about how to network, lifestyle, like real life shit. Everything that I've been teaching you in all of the classes, this is your chance to use it now in person. You're going to see me use it. You're going to see me apply it. This is what I want you to start doing. Crop things that you think are funny. Crop things that you think are like, oh, shit, she's spitting game. Crop those things, okay, and post them and tag me, you know, but this next content this next thing that we about to do is about to be so fun so i just hope y'all excited for what's to come you know a lot of y'all don't know but i have um this teeth company gables i smile um we're doing some work together okay and um yeah it's big man shit happening now y'all like your girl's really famous now thank y'all and i'm gonna make sure i do everything i can to use it to the best of my ability and to help people with it period Make sure you like, a, leave a like, a comment, and subscribe. Okay, go ahead. He said this is... So this is the Coral Gables location. Okay. As you know, we're right on Ponce de Leon. Mm. And of course, next to the new Lowe's, which is the hotel there. Oh, 2811. <laughs> 2811 on a building. And I'll bring you over here so you could see. We're here Monday through Friday. Okay. So we here have two operatories. We do a lot of the full mount designs mm. here. That's what we do. Okay. One, full two. mount design, yes. Yeah. This is another one here. Okay, okay. Okay, and we see age no limitation. We see mm. everyone and everything. Panoramic, state of the art, everything. Okay, CT scan, panel, everything. We're digital. Sheesh. We're pay paperless as well. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. And bathroom. We don't. <laughs> and I'm going to bring you back here. And this is one of our doctors. Hello. She's about to give birth to a beautiful baby boy. Congratulations. Yes. She did Zach. Oh, you did Zach's tea. Yeah. And this is another doctor we have here and a hygienist. This is hey, this is, this is Zach. Girl. I was gonna say this is Zach. Let's this is on. Zach. <laughs> <laughs> I saw that. I saw one of those and I ordered it mm -hmm. and it didn't show up. What you mean it didn't show I up? Was like what the heck? I got the one on the little stick. Oh, I don't know about that. Where yeah. you got it from? I got it from China. Oh, that's why. That's not from China. Yeah. You gotta go Best Buy. Oh. And what does that do? This is like a portable camera, so it can track you. Yeah, with a stabilizer, so, you know, no rigid. Oh, you didn't tell me about that one. Mm -hmm. That's so cool. So, no, you don't need the phone, huh? No, because it can record vertically, too. Mm -hmm. What do you do? You just move the lens here? Yep, so let's... Yep, very mm -hmm. good. So, we're going to sit here and we're going to talk, the four okay. of us, okay, a little okay. bit. Um, Your final destination for destiny. Your final destination for dentistry. You say what? They valid. They valid. Certified. Watch out. No, I'm a little bit stubborn. All right, you can stop it. Talking about numbers here with Ariana. Yeah. She's she's all into numbers. You don't mind me saying that, do you? Yeah. yeah. He you? knows. He knows this. This is incredible. Mm -hmm. You know, with numbers. I price, I price all my stuff now. I've, the sum of it, because I met Gary, the numbers guy, and uh, he lives right in Trump, right near me, mm -hmm. in Sunny Island. That's the guy that taught me. He's he's got small world. You know that we yeah. that's yeah. But literally, he has like half a billion hashtag for GG thirty three. So he knows his stuff. He went on a run with social media. So at the beginning of twenty twenty three, he was only big on Twitter. We got together. He brought me numerology. He was like, hey, I'm looking for influence who can help me get this out. I said, okay, 
fair enough. Tell me about it. It was my birthday. Gave me the reading. It was like, you know, you went through this divorce. Your family went through this divorce growing up. I'm like, how did you know that? He was like, you know, your birthday is pretty special, which is why I chose you. So if you can help me promote this, then I'll give you this numerology information for free. A lot of his numerology information, his higher class, like he was telling you about, like $28,000. So, you know what I'm saying? So after that, he was like, I was mostly on TikTok at the time. I wasn't Instagram. He's on Instagram more so now. Like He's the big one on Instagram. I just started Instagram. So I started helping him out on TikTok, and now he's at about... 700 yeah gary's at like 700,000 about to hit a million strictly off of tiktok and his numbers so all of you get together in our room to talk is that how things get done you just get divinely pulled and yeah feet bring you there mm -hmm. i got invited to a yacht gary was hosting mm -hmm. paid for the whole yacht and then he gave us all a reading at the same time and i was like that's a generosity that i haven't seen in a while yeah just brings us all out. Talking lots of politics, giving us kind of like, this is what's about to happen for the next year. So he's like a mentor to all of you, huh? You can say that. I, to me especially, yeah. And for you? You're mostly doing business, right? Yeah, mainly business. With him? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So now how do we do business together, all of us? We put our social medias together and we create more influence. We start making content together. I told him we should do a podcast. Exactly. I told her we should do a I'm podcast. Sure the same day. I said, That's the best way for you to I look said, in our I mouth. Said you have a lot of influencers, but which ones are giving you brain consulting? Mm. Because the real reality is like a perspective I have is very unique. And I'm not, I'm talking about the now, the now. Like, what, yeah. could, what could you do with your content team that could bring you now energy? Podcast. Yep. And I told her right from the beginning, I said, you don't have not a lot, of, a lot of space here, but you could, you know, set something out even outside doing mm -hmm. interviews. Yeah. And just doing interviews outside. Yeah. I said, hey, when's the last time you actually had a teeth cleaning? Yeah. <laughs> and then just show them, mm -hmm. like, what happens when you don't get teeth cleaning and, you know, what gets built up. Educate them. I would love for education. you to do that for me. Go out in okay. the community and ask. Okay. Ask, mm -hmm. what was your last mm -hmm. cleaning and how do we go about it and start you know, gathering, because look, um, we do regular clean mm -hmm. x-rays, and you know, Zach could speak from experience. Mm -hmm. We do not just take one x-ray. Mm -hmm. X-ray, we do multiple x-rays. We do a panoramic, um, and we do a regular cleaning for sixty nine ninety five mm -hmm. in Coral Gates. You got to tell us about your process, too. we mic you up once you talk about that whole process. Uh, process for what? The tea. Your tea. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah when yeah. you told me the story, you was like, and now I was like, that should have been for real. And he knows exactly what the process is. Some people mm -hmm. do not do temps, others do. Mm -hmm. You wanted a temp, I wanted a temps. I did not want temps. But you, <laughs> want, you were going to do something. Weren't you going to do something I took, that you needed? I, took, I didn't do the temps at all. I thought you did. No, I left them all. You did? Oh, I was Because I didn't have any sensitivity at all. Yeah, mm. I walked out and was like, all right, well, my teeth are, you know, a oh, little right. bit, uh, like, sensitive to breathing. Like, I can mm. feel a little bit, like, but I was able to eat and everything. Okay. Very fine, very small amount came off, you know, just rounded, but I didn't put the temps on. You did, and I thought you did. Yeah. The thing is that there's also a myth that they people think that their teeth, their own teeth are going to be very tiny. Hmm. Mm -hmm. And that's not true. Mm-hmm. Explain on that. Okay. Well, you well, explain because well, you well, went well, through it. Well, before, I think the old process was that they made it this, a nub. Mm -hmm. where they, like, shaved it down and made yeah. a cap. Yeah. And now it's not like that. It's just ultra-thins. So the ultra-thins just lay on the surface, on the, on the very surface. It's like a contact oh. lens. Mm -hmm. What did you talk about? Oh. So it's so thin, it looks like a contact uh, lens. You can still see my teeth. Yeah. You see them? Oh. Mm-hmm. You can see how they're cast, but <laughs> they're not like the a face. cap, it's yeah. just the face. Okay, and okay. it's very thin, and we just put it on top. Okay. And that's how it is. So you taught me something new. That whole, that whole myth that your yeah. teeth are going to be tiny, the terminology that is used out there, oh, they're going to shave my teeth. Yep, yep. And no, well, he was not intense, so imagine we prep his teeth, they basically stay almost the same, correct? Mm -hmm. We clean mm. them up. 
and then they actually looked better after they shaved it down a little bit yeah, because they were more rounded and mm. more like not I looked at my teeth before and I was like damn actually what's crazy is they make them look very polished and mm. smooth like I could have went and just with my smile like that Okay, okay, but we okay. need to protect it. Yeah. Because yeah. no matter what, we remove some of that, you know, mm-hmm. animal, basically. So we basically protect it. Okay. And I have them on, you have them on. It doesn't feel like anything different. I would say mm. it takes you like 10 days for your mouth to recalibrate, and then you mm. feel like they're your teeth. Mine took a little longer. Everybody yeah. is different. For me, it took over a month. Yeah. Look yeah. <laughs> but and my, yours is my, too. My bite and everything. I've, I've people say, yo, you have really, really nice teeth. And I'm like, yeah, they're veneers. I'm like, no way. <laughs> and they're like, I would have not suspected those are veneers. Yeah. Just because they got the natural yeah. um, selection. Is this Hollywood? No, this is not Hollywood. This is natural. Okay, okay, okay. It's a combination between two different. You have a combination of um, Hollywood, mature, and natural. Yeah. Mm, okay, because okay. Hollywood is too aggressive, mm. too square. Yeah. And for his face, that was not gonna work. And it was okay. just based off of my teeth. My teeth actually yeah. had more of a natural look to them anyway. So yeah. Mm-hmm. You don't want to go completely away from yeah natural look. Is, I agree. You know, yeah. You might as well just go with similar. Yeah. Because then people are like, wait a minute, like, did you actually get your teeth done? Yeah. You're fooling them. <laughs> Yeah. You're fooling them with beautiful teeth. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And don't let them fool you and tell you to get number two. I got number one because I went all, all the way bright. Okay, okay, okay. Saying <laughs> that said. because I didn't want them to see so white and know. Zach, no. So what color is yours? I'm a two. I don't know, Zach. I don't know, Zach. I might go two. I, I don't know about number two being a number two, but I gotta be. Oh number my God! One. He wanted to, and then I'm like, okay. And then what did I say after we put them on? I like them. The complexion oh, of your skin definitely yeah. matters. Obviously, yes. You know, being very fair skinned, mm-hmm. I do have it so that it doesn't look like there is mm-hmm. one. So you could get away with it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Get away with yeah. It Absolutely. I I would. Although my complexion is not dark, I don't yeah. think it would have looked good. I'm more. Yours are really nice. Yeah, I like. Yeah. Very natural. But you, you saw me without them yeah. before. Yeah. You saw me without them. So when did you do this one? Like when Almost did you? the same time as you. Yeah, almost oh. like, what, like two weeks in between? Yeah. yeah. Okay, when okay, I okay. There, when I was in Tampa, I go, look, Zach, I'm going through this. And mm. so him and I, yeah, it was almost around the same time. You're right. Mm-hmm. But okay, okay. It feels natural, but it does take a little time to adjust. And my teeth were really never shaved or anything like that. Oh, okay, 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 yeah. No. But I have to say, mm-hmm. in his case, we didn't have to align his teeth. Mm. His teeth were pretty straight. Mm-hmm. In my case, I needed to align them. In your case, most likely we'll be able to okay. align them and then do it after. Okay. Yeah. Every case is different. Yeah. You know, we have a patient that one of his tooth is so back that he put resin, you know, chair side resin Mm -hmm. veneers, meaning the same material or product that is used for cavities. Mm -hmm. They actually shape it in the tooth and they Uh, do a chair side veneer. Yeah. Made out of resin. It's cheaper. The color. Will ne- this will not stain what him and I have. Okay. The, the chair side does stain mm. and it chips. This doesn't chip. Okay. Now what happened with him is his tooth was so back that he had he had resin veneers, mm-hmm. or composite veneers, mm-hmm. and they filled it so much to make sh- and it looked bulky. So that's why they chip because they're composite? Many people chip because they're composite. Mm, okay, okay, okay. Yeah. And they Learning so much. Color and everything. Learning so much. Yeah. But the, out there, many people are getting those composite veneers. Yeah. They look beautiful the first day if you have a master that knows how to do them. Mm-hmm. It's got to be an artist. Yeah. You're basically drawing them on you yeah. and doing the shape manually. Okay. This come directly from the lab. Mm. So it's perfect. This yeah. is perfection. And this, what him and I have, another one. lasts forever. Yeah. You see that? Yeah. <laughs> I like a, that. It's a difference. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You know? Mm-hmm. The color is the same, <laughs> the shape is, you know, so all that happens. I've had, mm-hmm. I've had well over 50 compliments. Yeah. Yeah. Just like, 
Na that's one of the craziest things to like be in the space mm. of like other people's personal space and be like the first thing that they notice. Yes. Like, yo, your teeth fire. And I'm like, gable size smile. Exactly. But what happened is now when you're into this realm, mm -hmm. you're going to be talking to people looking at their teeth. Mm. Okay, before, yeah, you would look, but once you have them, now when he meets someone or me, the first thing you do yeah. is look at their teeth. Yeah. Right? We That's become true. more conscious. Mm hmm. You know, and sometimes we're like, oh my God, I wish they could fix their teeth, you know? Mm -hmm. And it is affordable. There's this myth that this cannot be affordable. Yes, it can be affordable. Mm -hmm. Either financing mm -hmm. or take advantage of specials, but we all can do it. Yeah. And it's not necessarily vanity because teeth is something that... It's important, yeah. It's important. It's your health. You know, it's important. And if you look good, you feel good. Mm -hmm. Hey, what happens? You do good. You do. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. So and the this... more you smile, the more you make other people smile. That's true, because your smile is contagious. Yeah. yeah. But that's his presentation mm -hmm. business card. You know what I mean? Yeah. That's it. This is it. And mm -hmm. you use it and plant it, right? Yes. Of course. Yes. Yeah. For always, sure. Always planting seeds. Don't mm -hmm. I, I do not regret it. I highly recommend it. And you know where to go to get it. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Another thing is that people don't know how many. How many should I get? The way that you, we do it is basically asking you to smile and see exactly how many teeth you show. Mm -hmm. If you're a person that smiles little and only show four, why spend all the money in doing mm -hmm. everything? Mm -hmm. So we go based. Smile big. He shows ten on the top. Mm -hmm. Imagine if we would have only done four or two. It looks yeah. awkward. You know? So that that is something that we to take that we do take into consideration. Okay. The amount because they're individual. Mm -hmm. So you're able to floss, you're able to brush your teeth, you're able to do things like normal teeth. Yet you must floss how often? Every day. Every day. <laughs> and you must get cleanings done how often? Every two months. Three, four, five, six, nine. If you have healthy teeth every six months okay if you have what's called periodontal disease then you need to come every three months okay and periodontal disease is a disease that it is not curable it is treatable but not curable mm -hmm. so that's why when i see gummy time to go oh my god you gotta come to the dentist let the yeah. doctor see you because what really holds your teeth is the root and what holds the root mm. of your teeth is the bone mm. and when you have periodontal disease that bone is eaten mm. by that bacteria. So that's why as you get older, you see that people don't have teeth. Or why is it that people are losing their teeth? Mm -hmm. Very simple. You're losing teeth because there's a bacteria that is eating them up. Mm. Yeah. So that's what holds it. You know? And that's important. And we're not going to just put veneers on mm. you unless we do cleaning. And you could speak on that. Was yourself. it painful? No. Really? No anesthetic. I mean, really. I know it'd be uncomfortable. They, they went a little over the top and did the anesthetics, but honestly, I think everybody's tooth sensitivity is different. Mm, it's okay. based off of your oral health care to begin with. Because mm -hmm. honestly, I didn't even have any sensitivity after they yeah. shaved it down. And they told me, just be very cautious with your teeth. You cannot bite hard. You can. You gotta be careful chewing food. I was in the restaurant going. <laughs> I was eating hot food. And I was like, my my teeth are good. Yeah. You know, but she said she had more sensitivity. I did. So, mm -hmm. you know. Is that still the case now that you have to be mindful of what you bite into? I mean, you, you always know. should. Yeah. Oh, okay. Do it with yeah. your own teeth. You're not gonna. Uh -huh. You know. Yeah. It's not. You gotta take care of your teeth. That's like true. You do you know regular? But oral health is very important, absolutely. Mm -hmm. That goes without saying. We're not going to put veneers unless we do a cleaning on mm -hmm. you, unless we check if you have cavities. Mm -hmm. It's ridiculous. Just, yeah. Just and people just will, yeah. people will like have cavities and they'll still do them. And... No comment. There we go. No comment. But it, it is important that the foundation is healthy, mm -hmm. you know, because if we were to find any cavities, we're going to take care of them before mm -hmm. we actually do that. Okay. You know? 
and then look around look around where you are going to what dentist you're going to or what dental office mm -hmm. because right now anybody thinks that they could do this so there's this thing that's like going really popular right now oil pulling like what do you think about that oil oil pulling like the people are using like coconut oil on their teeth and like spitting it out like does that actually have any benefits i'm not a dentist i'm not a doctor okay mm -hmm. but all this homeopathic remedies mm -hmm. and strategies to each his own i i no comment <laughs> but yeah you hear exactly it. you hear it out there uh, some people say oh you have bad breath just use um, peroxide and rinse with that or you have a toothache just rinse with peroxide and it'll be all gone hmm you know what i mean you need an x-ray, it needs to be evaluated, it needs to see exactly yeah. what you have. And the oil pulling, let me tell you, I never heard of that. Oh, wow. Is that a trend that's out there? Uh, I don't know. This, this is like something that's... Uh, do you, on them. So it's like, it's like they have this peppermint or thick coconut that you just squish it around for five minutes. And it's supposed to take out all of the bacteria, black stuff come out. I don't believe in it. But how is it possible that, you see, the bacteria is inside the gum and by the bone. You cannot see that. Hmm. Things don't go just in there like that. Wow. There's something know. new. So it doesn't make sense. Hold on hey, a second. Just because the Tide Pods Elisa challenge. Oh it's my God! Changing. Doesn't mean Do it right. <laughs> I know, right? But I think it's probably fine if you eat the oil and you try to do something like that. But probably won't do as much as what they probably won't do as much as they market it to do. Yeah. Look, whatever whatever the hype is, is to sell something. Yeah. At the end of the day, that's what they're trying to do, because this thing of teeth whitening that they're putting some type of charcoal. Charcoal? Yeah, dame, dame donde van los dientes. La muestra del yes, implante. El ejemplo, la muestra grandota. They're trying to sell. What about that. people that do the whitening with the with the light? That's another hype. It's a show. Mm. Because we could do People get burned. We could do whitening now mm -hmm. without that light. What about mm. the purple stuff? You know what happens, right? What That's, purple stuff? You eat, yeah, it's a purple. It's purple like a true Okay, tell me, what happens? They use purple and then it, it's supposed to like... It's like a dye. Like a dye or color. Of what about turmeric? I, I just what about turmeric? Turmeric is good for your health. I tried it. I brushed my teeth with turmeric. Yeah, what is that going to do? I don't know. I thought it whitened it a little bit. The thing is that don't forget. <laughs> I don't do it every day. Like, I tried it like twice. You don't want your enamel, your natural enamel to go away. Okay. You know, and again, I'm no dentist. I don't know. And what is your enamel? That shiny thing that you see there, that's your enamel. Oh. Yeah. yeah. Okay, okay. Drink two Coca-Colas a day and you'll find out. I don't drink no Coca-Colas. Tú sabes la cajita donde uno muestra el implante y todo. Por favor. Por favor. I'm going to show you something so you could understand. Let me see where these people are. But this is interesting. I love it. I have a question too. Yes. So we have a lot of like coffee and tea drinkers. I've heard that we should drink through a straw. Is that correct? Well, so for the coffee drinkers, anything with color, wine mm. has color, marinara sauce has color, uh, tomato sauce, mm. ketchup, um, sodas, mm -hmm. tea, all that has a color. stain mm -hmm. and that stain your color and that stains your natural tea mm. zach and i could eat all of that and we're not gonna get stained <laughs> <laughs> you know okay what I mean? okay so that that happens i gracias no you see this is what i'm talking about this here is the root of your tooth okay this is what you see the gum Okay, mm -hmm. this white here is bone. Okay. So when you have periodontal disease, okay, or when this is really inflamed and red, food as you're eating gets stuck in there. 
Mm. That food becomes bacteria. Mm -hmm. That bacteria starts eating the bone. And then this bone becomes up to here. So the root has really nothing anymore to hold it in, mm. in place. So that is called periodontal disease. So we want to make sure that this is healthy. Okay. You know what I mean? And that periodontal disease does not eat what is protecting the root of our teeth. So you see all these elders mm -hmm. losing their teeth? Mm -hmm. It's because that bone must be up here, down here rather. You understand? Yeah. So when you're telling me that oil, how is it possible that that oil is getting oh. down there? That's the part that I'm not understanding. Hmm. You know so what I mean? So the oil is more of a topical form. Correct. So the oil, if anything, is here. Mm. It's not protecting this. And that's the Frankenstein, just in case you got to jolt back to life. <laughs> this is an implant. Wow. So <laughs> what happens is you have a missing tooth, right? Once you have a missing tooth, there is nothing here anymore, meaning that mm. by you not having this, you lose bone. Because this has nothing to yeah. wrap. So if you don't have, if you ha are missing a tooth, the best thing to do is to place an implant. Mm. An implant made out of titanium is there. It wraps everything up. We put what's called an abutment. And then we'll put a crown. And the person will have... And it looks exactly, believe me when I tell you, it looks exactly like one of your teeth. Mm. Okay, I do not have any implants, but I know many people that have them, and you cannot even tell. If you don't want an implant, you put a bridge, and the bridge is permanent. We cement that permanent. Mm. The only thing is that you cannot really floss in between, but there are special flosses that you could do for bridges. Okay. So, hey, in dentistry, there's a fix for everything, mm -hmm. okay? The other thing that we do a lot of is that tongue detox. I was just about to, yeah. So you said, I know you're talking about for smokers especially. The tongue detox yeah. should be for everybody. Mm -hmm. That biofilm, that white biofilm that people mm -hmm. have in their tongue, we clean that out. Mm -hmm. And that's it. That really helps you with the bad breath. Mm -hmm. And the dryness in your mouth mm -hmm. and everything. So we do all that. Especially for, like I said though, I, I know a lot of smokers, y'all need to go ahead and do that, the tongue detox. Yes, 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 yes. And anybody with bad breath, hey, tell them. But I was, so she was telling me. <laughs> Speak your mind up, She right? was telling me that the scraper that people are using are a little bit too rough, actually, for our tongue. But what do you mean too rough? When like she, at least that's what she told me. Yeah. She said that that's I was using. People don't forget the tongue has little hairs. Yeah. Protected. Some people go crazy. Yeah, you know? she said I was going too rough. Everything. So be careful with that too. Yeah, 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 yeah. You don't want to do anything too rough. You don't want to floss yeah. too rough. You, you want to use a soft, brittle brush. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. not brittle, rather, not hard. And it says it, soft. Mm -hmm. Buy a soft toothbrush. Okay. Yeah, not too many. But overall, just come see the dentist. Exactly. Minimum every six months. Right? In my case, every month. <laughs> Why every month? What do you do that you need to come every month? Yeah, you come down here. <laughs> no, no, Zach is a speed dial one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and of course, eat healthy. Of course. Drink a lot of water. Mm -hmm. Careful with the own? soda. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I don't drink soda, don't but drink soda yeah. But you're into that water thing that you talk about all the time, right? Yeah, I have the ignatic water plus uh, magnetic. Uh, neodymium magnet that I re-energize the water. Mm -hmm. so technically, as soon as the water comes out of the faucet, it hits mm -hmm. metal. Yeah. It loses the magnetism. Mm -hmm. So you're drinking dead water. Mm. So you have filters at your place too? Oh yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I have an eight thousand dollar magnetic machine, and then that rehydrogenizes it, mm -hmm. pulls it, filters it. Mm -hmm. uh, probably does reverse osmosis, so I can pull almost. 99.99% out of it mm -hmm. becomes medical grade water and mm -hmm. then I take that water and then put it through a neodymium magnet which mm -hmm. is a filter mm -hmm. that you just pour it through 
this is a big neodymium magnet. And as soon as it puts it through that, adds the electrical charge back to it, and I drink it mm -hmm. that way. Yeah, they put a lot of salt in the water now. It's more something that's subtle. Uh, it's the same reason why an animal would drink out of a stream versus a puddle. Mm. They're not going to go drink out of a puddle. Mm -hmm. You're going to watch them go to the stream first. And they would be right next to each other. We're animals. We're hunters. We yeah, we're, we're, at heart, yeah. We're, 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 des we're desensitized animals. Because mm -hmm. yeah. we get in the shower with them. We're not water. relentless no more. You, you go in the shower. Yeah. You wonder why your energy feels a little bit more sapped after a water. You feel refreshed. Or you feel that dryness yeah, feeling too. But the, real, the reality of it is, is that water is actually sapping a lot of the electric amperage from you. Because mm -hmm. it's dead water. It doesn't have the magnetism. I'm wondering if that water is also very good for your teeth and... Mm -mm. No? Mm -mm. no, no I, have, I, have right a I have a magnet on my uh, water head and then also a magnet in my sink. What about water, water, water flossers? What do you think about that? Oh, they're very good. Okay. Very, very good. Okay. Very good. We actually sell them here. Do you use it or not? I know I don't have one, but I would. I don't know if we have any. I just place an order and they win like hotcakes. Yeah, I heard about those water flossers. Mm -hmm. Yeah, especially for a person that does not like to floss regularly. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That is really the way. She, you know okay. what I mean? That helps because yeah. it flushes everything out. Mm -hmm. but yeah. Some dentists do not like it. Others do. Um, we do recommend it for mm -hmm. those patients that are either have um, veneers or they have braces or Invisalign, you know what I mean, mm -hmm. or crowns or bridges because this is a perfect example. If you see this bridge is cemented permanently, mm -hmm. since you cannot flow us, the water pick will take yeah. that out. Because that bacteria that we're talking about is the one that will filter through here mm -hmm. and the water pick will help it wash out. And your gums will be nice and healthy and pink. You always want to make sure that that mm -hmm. is healthy. So. so if someone's gums are dark, that's because? Dark, no. What you need to look into is inflame mm. or red. Mm. The darkness, all that is, you know, complexion. Your okay. gum color is different than mine mm -hmm. because our skin color. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Okay, yeah. That has nothing to do. Okay. That's how our gene, you know, genetic, and that's how we are. Okay. But when it comes to red or inflamed, that's okay. bacteria. Okay. And no matter what, what color your gum is and what color my gum is, mm -hmm. red is red. You know when your gums are red. Yes. Okay, okay, you know that that goes without saying. Okay, okay. okay yeah. Yeah. That's how we do it. By the way, now that you said that we do dentures, a lot of dentures, especially mm. in Miami. And when we select the gum color, there's different gum colors that we select for the patient. Mm. So a person with color, we will select a gum color that's different. Mm -hmm. Or we do a transparent because now... It also comes transparent. What we're trying to do is assimilate as much as we can to the natural. Mm -hmm. You know, of yeah. that particular individual. It's all aesthetics. Yeah. Even a person that has dentures, we could make them look beautiful. Yeah. No matter what. Yeah. That's and healthy. That's the key. Healthy. You're better off not having teeth than having rotten teeth mm -hmm. because that filters through your heart system. Yeah. And that bacteria that I'm talking about filters through your heart system and you wow. get heart attacks and we have a you get heart attacks because of your teeth your, the disease. Number wow one, mm -hmm, number one cause goes through your whole system mm -hmm, the veins and everything and it goes to the heart wow we have a patient that had a surgery heart to heart because of periodontal disease yeah he had an issue and mm. he cut him mm-hmm yeah. Wow. So when we see that, we Mouth rather is remove important. all the teeth that are no good. That's why periodontal disease is like, and it's contagious. If you have periodontal disease and you're kissing someone, that bacteria, you're giving it to that other person. Oh my gosh, y'all hear that? Mm -hmm. <laughs> wow. <laughs> That's a good flashlight, open that mouth. <laughs> <laughs> no, for real. Let me see what's in the eyes. No, for real. It's contagious, yeah. Oh, no. Yeah, periodontal disease is mm -mm. contagious. Yeah. You gotta look at it as an STD, basically. Yeah, you know no, I mean? yeah. Is there any way you could know what someone has? A dentist could maybe, but you measure pockets and you know it based on that. Because we have she said, pockets. Oh, 
We have pockets and we measure it three, four, five, six, three, four, five, six, and we know. How common is it? Periodontal disease. Between 60 to 70% of the population has periodontal disease. Let's, let's look at it. Damn, kissing just got a whole new level. Oh my yeah. God, tell me about it. Oh, you have no clue, periodontal disease. Let's see. I don't want to do stages, but maybe. How do I know? <laughs> That's crazy. I thought she was going to be like 30%. Well, look, world Jeez. population. Oh no, it's big. Whoa, one billion? Yeah, but this is nineteen percent it, worldwide. It's it's different, but it, it is it is here. It's like it's one in seven people. Globally, twenty to fifty percent around the world. I went a little bit high. Wow. Yeah. But that's still high. That is high. That is that's high. That's high. Yeah. For the whole world. Two out of ten. And here it says periodontal DC, seventy percent of adults. Oh, okay. My number was somewhat right because. 70% above adults 65 years. So mm. if you're 65 years or older, 70% of the population has it. So if, if you're, you're looking for a sugar daddy? Be careful. <laughs> Woo! You if, better drink and Be careful, for sugar, real. Because yeah. you might not be touching them, but if you're kissing them. If a younger 20 to 50% of the population. <laughs> Wow, flossing. learn something new. <laughs> yeah, flossing, taking care of. So forget about the sugar daddy, right? Yeah. <laughs> that sugar daddy might have, um, or sugar mama, might have yeah. the uh, periodontal disease. It happens. That's what we're doing. Sheesh. With. It is an eye opener. Yeah, it is. This is the part that it is not said in the social media. Yeah. It's the part that is not touched. Okay? Yeah. Yeah, it is. Wow. That's why all these people that just getting these veneers without really having a good checkup, they'll mm -hmm. end up without teeth in a couple of years. <laughs> you gotta, you gotta get a <laughs> whole new report on a person when they come in to Yeah. Like, all right, let me see your mouth. Open up. Let me get your, let me mm -hmm. get your blood. Yeah. yeah. You know, one thing that I do, I do buggos. Buy one, get one, the buggo. Mm -hmm. Come and get a cleaning, buy one, get one, because all we want to do is make sure that, you know, come in couples. Let's see, because if I have periodontal disease, you better believe it, my husband. If I kiss him all the time, you better believe it. He might have it too. Sheesh. Mm -hmm. Yep, it happens. That's why when we sit a patient that the periodontal, the periodontal disease is so advanced, we ask, bring your significant other. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Bring them because the likelihood is there. Mm -hmm. it happens mm. so we do treat the packages that's what it is that's what I'm it is isn't, isn't it I'm about to bring my girl in and be like get your mouth checked yeah yeah you have to I tried to get her today but I was like I don't know if they're going to have one please you know the, the person that does my nails you're not putting this in social media right? Can you turn off stop it? yeah, yeah. stop it You heard me? You heard said Zach? Mm -hmm. Zach, you heard said said we gotta talk. Oh yeah. But yeah definitely I, gotta talk. I just um I just have different uh different level of awareness when it comes to an offer, right? Yeah. Because I'm like, where's the value exchange? Mm -hmm. You want me to post what everybody else is doing. The veneers are, and this is for someone that in reality, his and mine are thinner because this one, this person had um, very thin teeth, you know, itself. But look, you see, that's why your whole tooth is in the back. Mm. So that's a veneer. Isn't that pretty? Oh, wow, that's thin. Mm -hmm. You say yours is thinner? Mine is, but his is even thinner than mine. But that's so you could have an idea how these things are. Wow. Incredible. Yeah. I'm here. Okay. So, I'm recording in two albums. Okay. Always is principal camera. Okay. I got a little. Mira. Yes, the next
Porque si no. What's up, everybody? My name is Oriana, but you may know me as Styx. I am so excited. On the 28th, I get to partner with Coral Gables I Smile to have a whole new smile, whole new look. And you guys know I'm very big about aesthetic alchemy. So I just want to say I'm super excited for this transformation. I know I'm going to come out looking better than I came. And I can't wait for you guys to see it. Thank you. Smile, smile, and move, and move. Yes, yes, aha, uh -huh. there, move, perfect, okay? So look at the camera, look at the camera, move, perfect, perfect, yes. And then you look at me, mm -hmm. perfect, okay. Perfect, guys, that's super good, okay. Okay, in this, in this picture, mm -hmm. so, and like this, okay. so, look over there, I'm normal, I'm mm -hmm. fashion, I'm... Okay. 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 I take them. Okay, let me take a moment. Yes, one, two, and two. Perfect, one more. One, two, and two. Pero, está bien, Mario. Ok, one, one more, one more. One, two, and three. Yes. Perfect, one more. One, two, and three. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Perfect, you go up there. Yes, ajá. One, two, and three. Perfect, one more. One, two, and three. Okay, so look at me. Aha. Perfect. One, two, three. One, two, three. Perfect. Okay, in the little bit turn. Yes, more turn. Aha. Perfect. Aha, look at me. Yes, look at me. One, two, three. Aha. One, two, three. Oh, oh yeah, I like that. That's a beautiful smile. And when did you get that done? No, when? Oh, when? It's been about four months. Maybe. Mm. A little more, I think. Yeah. A little more. Any pain? Huh? Any pain? At all. Wow. It's super easy. You keep it light, keep it simple. You, you, know, you do your little, uh, what you call it, the, the air. Yeah. The water pick. Thing, the water pick. You do the water pick? Yes. Okay, yeah. That's the best thing. And so this is good. Zach. It's easy. Hey, Zach, Zach, Zach Eric, Eric, Eric and me. Pleasure. Zach, 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 Zach. Wow, that's so beautiful. Look at that. Yeah. The top and bottom. Okay, yeah. So you're gonna do it? Yeah. Oh, I know, right? Oh, yes, I've and seen enough smiles through. Thank you. But are you get of the white, 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 white? 